Hi, brothers and sisters. I had a dream about the watchmen and watchwomen still getting up to faithfully lead and teach at the podium, even when their shoes were blue. They were blue. And even when they were wearing black in mourning over perhaps lost loved ones, things ending, or love grown cold. The watchmen and women would say a paragraph or two and ask a few questions. And the listeners actually carried the speakers with their encouraging responses and enthusiasm and even their songs. And then suddenly the master returned to find us doing exactly what we were supposed to be doing. Praise Jesus, our joyful Jesus. We'd made many new friends in the Lord in the quote unquote online library. <laughs> and now it was time to hang out and have a down home meal together full of holy peace and love and comfort and warmth and joy and camaraderie, and fellowship, perhaps even followed by a royal ball as princes and princesses ready for a little toe tapping. Silver rewards were given to those refined by fire, carried by the oil of the Holy Spirit, the olive branch, our peace, our torches burning brightly, strong as oaks, only as one in our Lord who was crucified on a tree, sowing seeds. I saw the top big boss from upstairs sitting in the midst of the people as the fair judge who was watching and he was watching me even as I was preparing to speak and speaking. I knew I wasn't perfect as I unrolled the papers I'd written my speech on. And while many gems came out of the speech, I jumped around to many topics and drifted at times, saying things perhaps about America, but then acknowledging the beautiful things God made and God made the world and everything in it. People were tuning out as they sharpened their own pencils to write, but I had one more important thing to explain that people could take with them and share themselves. I had to be sure people had a tool to share the good news, the gospel, and I explained the gospel via the gospel bracelet, and then saw them doing the same thing, multiplying our efforts. Young men saying something like, our hearts were dark with sin, but then the light of Jesus entered in. His blood he shed, it was red, and now our hearts are bright with his light, white like snow, and we grow like green trees down on our knees. We know that to the blue heavens we'll go, where we'll be purple royalties. I then saw a live clip of the big boss upstairs speaking like he was on a Zoom call. He was in the grass outside holding a guinea pig and he revealed his sense of humor as he indicated it looked like some of our retired folks. I then saw a yellow cat playfully chasing what I thought was a happy rabbit and then the rabbit chasing the cat in a beautiful sunny spring day and as the animals ran up to me to pet them I realized how much the big boss upstairs loves animals and I felt assured that all of our pets would indeed be in heaven with us. Thank you Jesus. Amen.